hates to be tricked. There's no way he'll have to Sith trick him again. As for whether or not he'll be my son again, I... I don't know. He's so full of anger and hate. I wasn't expecting him to be like this. Well, maybe we can work it out. I, I hope so. I, I guess I'll have to wait and see. Thanks, by the way, for all your help.
What? Hold it right there, whoever you are. We're not going back to the Academy. We'll kill you rather than go back. You mean you aren't here to kill us or bring us back? I find that hard to believe. The only way into these caves is through the Academy. You must be a Sith. So what is it then? If you're not here to kill us or bring us back, why are you here? Speak up! So you have heard about us. Yes, we ran away before Master Uthar could execute us. Is that so hard to believe? My name is Thalia May. The others here and myself refused to murder a bunch of people on a whim from Master Uthar. So here we are. We thought that becoming a Sith was what we always wanted, but that wasn't true. Now all we want is to get out of here. Fair enough? Help us? Why should I believe that this isn't some kind of trick? You want to help us? All right, I can think of a way. We're stuck in these caves, obviously, or we would have been long gone. There's a passage to the surface through the caves, but we're blocked by some kind of large creature. We can't defeat it. If you could kill it and clear up the passageway for us, we could escape. That would be help enough. Can you do that? It, it's clear? We can go. Thank you. This, I wasn't expecting help from anyone. I guess we aren't the only ones who don't agree with everything. Maybe. Maybe the Jedi will accept us. I've seen how evil the dark side is. Maybe I could try. At any rate, thank you again. You've saved our lives.
Yes, what's on your mind? If you're ready to talk, then yes, so am I. I can't hate you. I tried. I wanted to hold you responsible for all the things you've done for my... for my wife, for Telos, for Dustal. But I can't. I got the revenge I always wanted when Saul died, but it hasn't brought me the peace that I thought it would. Despite whatever part of Revan is inside you, the, the darkness that must surely be there, it isn't who you are. That's why I can't hate you, why I don't want any more revenge. You don't have to be Revan. You can be so much more. Whatever the Jedi did to you, they gave you that chance. Whatever's happened up until this point, there's going to come a time very soon where you're going to have to make a choice, and there won't be any turning back. Well, then I hope I can save you from yourself. How may I be of assistance to you, Padawan? What is it you would like to speak to me about? I have been doing well, I suppose. As well as I can. But I am more interested in you right now. Do not mistake me. It is just that, even though we have traveled together for a while, it seems I know next to nothing about you personally. We have been traveling together since Dantooine, but I know nothing of you before that. Would you... would you humor me and tell me a little bit about yourself? Your job? Your childhood? Your life? I am sorry if I am making you uncomfortable. I will fully understand if you choose not to answer. I greatly appreciate your taking the time to talk to me. How did you come to be on Dantooine? Besides the obvious, of course. Taras. It always seems to come back to Taras for me. I am sorry. I get distracted. I already know the tales of your exploits. How you defeated the Mandalorians in the war, and how you fell. But now you have the chance to redeem yourself, to make a new page in your history. So now, I suppose, that all does not matter. Only your life now does. But again, I seem to be wasting your time with my, my carrying on. I apologize.
Yeah, what do you want? Korriban is a Sith world, that's for sure. And rumor has it that the leader of our clan at the time, Mandalore, did go down. You have anything else? Your ch I doubt that. Greetings, Stu. Huh. Another hopeful wandering. <laughs> yeah! How do you do, Hope? May the Force. Just be careful if you... the latest trip to Master Uthar gives you an order. You'd better follow it. There were some students who disobeyed him. It is my most fervent hope to serve under Darth Malik once my training is complete. It is my most fervent hope. Still working to earn prestige? Hmm. Now that... The very... Do not forget our agreement regarding Euthura's treachery. We shall put her in her place. Should you reach the final test, that is. Ah, the ones I ordered executed for their mutiny. It's done, then. Indeed. We checked the caves and found only a couple of bodies. Perhaps the Shirak ate them. Eh, it is just as good, I suppose. The lesson is learned, I believe. Go now. You have done well, but you have not impressed me enough to declare you the victor. I have matters to attend to. You have gained considerable prestige. You are very close to the end. Do not falter now. Ready. Sure. You hanging around still? Don't... That's right. You might as well just... <laughs> Funny. Say that after I'm a full Sith and I'll grab... You hanging around still? You think I would tell you? There's nothing you know that I could possibly... You? I remember you from the colony. Just figure that out, did you? <laughs> it... A duel. 
Fine. You run along and get... I remember you. You're all right. That's true. I had no idea. The name's Chardin. Didn't I tell you that back in the colony? I don't work or play well with others. I remember. You want to challenge me? To I guess we'll meet eventually on my turn. What is it? Uh -huh. Yes? I hear that you have gained even more prestige. You are closing in on victory. This is good. Were I you, I would not get too excited just yet. You still have plenty left to do. I have been involved in the work there over the last couple of years, but not often. Most of the excavating is left to the students. What did you wish to know? Not unless you are accompanied by Master Uthar, no, it is strictly forbidden. And I truly doubt you could bypass the doors to the tomb with anything less than ship blasters. Even then, perhaps. None. I have searched many times, so do not bother. There is... We could learn much about the history of the... Perhaps... As you... Revan? You mean Darth... Very little. I never met him personally, though I heard he was a very powerful man. Very charismatic. In the end, Revan was outshone by his pupil. Such is the way of the Sith. Why? Is this dead man of importance to you? Is there any reason I should? Beside the fact I did not know Revan in life, Revan was known for wearing a full helmet and cape. Perhaps Revan's body had been disfigured by the power of the Force. It is not unheard of. Regardless, I doubt I shall be meeting Revan any time soon. Anything is possible. Uthar's former master still lives, though he is in no condition to challenge his former pupil for leadership. Perhaps the same is true for Revan. Perhaps Revan is out there, somewhere. More likely, what we were told is the truth. Fair enough. What? What's happened? Good. Let's keep... About myself. I am originally from Slaheron, if you must know. I was a slave to a cruel master, Omish the Hutt. I'm sure you don't need to know more. You are... Hello again. You're, uh, doing... I... oh, uh... Yes, my master always says I'm too trusting, too willing to sh... Uh, no, no, I, I really can't. Well, I, 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 I didn't mean... I, I, I shouldn't trust you. I, I can't trust you, can I? No, no, I shouldn't bother you with it. I, um, eh, forget I said anything. Just, uh...
You should be careful if you're planning on entering this tomb. It's dangerous. There's an assassin droid in there, so Master Uthar says. It went insane and is holed up in there with a whole army of droids protecting it. I don't know. I think Master Uthar has left it in there as a challenge for any student brave enough to destroy it. Supposedly, if a student actually succeeds in destroying the droid, they'll get a great reward. Lots have tried, but nobody's succeeded yet. No idea. I think it's building them in there. Seems that way. They say that its audio receptors became too sensitive and all the noise drove the droid nuts. If you're planning on going in, I suggest you use some sound suppressors or something, or you'll probably become a target right away. I... I don't think so. I can manipulate minds and living matter, but that won't be much use against droids, will it? I've had a few friends go inside that haven't come out for a while now. I doubt I could do any better than they could. Sure thing. Good luck.